people were segregated for a considerable amount of time. Pain, conflict, death, all that contributed towards uh, mistrust and misinterpretations. The way history was taught didn't allow for tolerance, didn't allow for respect to the other, or didn't allow respect to diversity. Şimdi öncelikle ben ee, tarih dersleri yaptığımda her zaman düşünürüm ki tarih dersleri her zaman tek taraflı anlatılıyor. Unfortunately in school syllabuses they do not include the whole truth. So I guess here comes the role of an NGO like the Association for Historical Dialogue and Research because it what it actually does is dealing with this problem of master narratives and the, their pernicious effects. Back in 2003, a group of educators, we decided to establish the Association for Historical Dialogue and Research. We wanted to introduce in Cyprus modern approaches to history teaching and modern pedagogies that will enable children and students to develop a historical understanding and critical thinking. And we were actually kind of labeled as uh, traitors to our own communities because we were collaborating with the members of other community. I remember uh, myself being kind of threatened uh, just because of this. And to learn the other's perspective. We had to bring together educators from across the existing divide. Imagine these people coming together to discuss about sensitive issues as the history teaching in Cyprus. At the political level, it was the fear across the divide of are they trying to do something more than that just teaching? Are they trying to change people's minds and identities? Hala erkek egemen bir dile sahiptir ve e, ulusal kimle vurgu yapmaktadır. Rum tarafında e, bir işgal adı altında anlatılan Türkiye çıkartması Türk tarafında Mutlu Barış Harekatı olarak anlatılır. Επειδή απλά μας εμάθαν το ότι μια μέρα να απλά έγινε μια εισβολή και απλά χωριστήκε η Κύπρος επειδή δεχόμαστε μια πλήση εγκεφάλου χωρίς να ξέρουμε πραγματικά το τι έγινε. Έπαινε το Μασαλί. We as teachers and teacher trainers needed material that would help us uh, tackle all these issues. Η μεθοδολογία του ομίλου ιστορικού διαλόγου ε, διαφέρει πάρα πολύ από το παραδοσιακό, το οποίο είναι το στερεότυπο που έχουμε μάθει χωρίς ε, κριτική, χωρίς ε, κριτική σκέψη, χωρίς αφισβήτηση, χωρίς αφιβολία. Tarihsel Diyalog ve Araştırma Merkezi, Araştırma Derneği'nin bizlere sunduğu seminer, çalıştay ve veya konferanslar sayesinde farklı açılardan konulara bakmayı öğrendik. The first is introduction. How do you approach missing persons across the existing divide? How do you talk about pain? How do you approach death? Show them this uh, photograph and you ask them who are these people? What are what are what are they going to say? I would say that for quite a while the two sides were almost unaware that there were missing persons in the other side. This issue on uh, missing persons uh, has been a uh, quite a sour issue for both sides in a sense and it was hijacked for a while for uh, by politicians. We thought that bringing the two stories together could be a, a very interesting topic for people in both communities and that would make people understand that uh, um, thinking historically about missing persons is not about Greek Cypriots or Turkish Cypriots. So you can see different elements of multiple perspectivity, historical thinking and uh, what in social psychology 
discussed in the context of intergroup relations and reconciliation uh, being combined in a single approach that I would call it the transformative approach. It's about uh, all Cypriots, it's about, in, in the end of the day, it's about every human being. Halkın Sesi gazetesine göre e, olay 26 Mayıs 1956'da oldu. Το πιο κάτω γεγονό, όπω καταχωρείται για να παραμείνει στην ιστορία, συνέβη στι 26 του Μάη 1956. Τουρκία ενόπλη πυροβόλησε εναντίον ανύποπτων θαμών ελληνικού καφενείου στο γειτονικό με την άσουσα μεικτό χωριό Αφάνια. Το άξιο Αφάνια, τα βουκούπουλαν χάδισε αρασίντα, μία κυπρίστη Τουρκ, ολμού, μία ευε, μία μοτοσυκλέτ, γιάννηστη. The Critical History Project uh, is uh, interesting because it uses a lot of primary sources, mostly newspapers, and if there was, let's say, an event of violence at one uh, uh, um, village, they will uh, see how it was reported by Greek Cypriots and Turkish Cypriots. Through the process of selective memory, we choose what we want to remember, therefore we they choose what they want to teach us. They don't teach us what happened. They teach us what they want us to know. By exposing that construction, we could also show uh, the multi-perspectivity of the situation. For example, you have a perpetrator who was a victim on other events, or a perpetrator becoming a victim on other events. So you, you could create the patterns and see all these uh, socio-political uh, backgrounds of uh, situations. So it wasn't just one day people just took the guns and started shooting at each other. So that helps to understand the other side's worries, but also politics <laughs> in that sense, in order to analyze uh, the situation. When you mix these stories, then you can be more πιο ρεαλιστής, να είσαι πιο κοντά στην πραγματικότητα του πώς νιώθει ο άνθρωπος και πώς συνέβηκαν κάποια θέματα. Going back to the past, I remember when we had no place to meet. Should we meet in the south? Should we meet in the north? Showing passports was also a difficulty. At some points, we could not access each other. Hi, Hello, Yalit. How, How are, are you? you? Fine. Oh, fine. Thank you. So, after so many years, so many efforts, having a cultural space, having NGOs literally living in the home for cooperation and working together is like the impossible becoming possible. The meeting place was another great challenge that we faced in the beginning of our uh, initiative as uh, Cyprus being divided geographically uh, between the two communities does not provide spaces where could be called shared spaces and easily accessible for members of both uh, communities across the existing divide. The Home for Cooperation is located in the buffer zone, inside the dividing line, inside, let's call it, uh, this kind of border. And um, borders are, of course, places that divide, but they, are, they can also be bridges and they can also be very creative spaces because they bring difference together. I like the idea that there is a place where there is no space between the two sides. And I believe that this place is in the middle of Cyprus, if there are more places that we can reach out to the other side, we can reach out to the other side and we can reach out to the other side ότι υπάρχει μια ελπίδα για το μέλλον. Μπορώ στο πάνω positive energy ve aslında hiçbir farklılığımız olmadığını belirten bir yer ve burada barışın olabileceği barış umudu ve insanların tek bir amacı olduğunu gösteriyor. This didn't exist a couple of years back, so uh, not everybody had the chance to say, you know what, I'm going to go in a neutral area where I can discuss some things with my fellow friends, my fellow Cypriots. By establishing a space, controlled, managed, administered, and uh, sort of uh, sustained by a bicommunal uh, NGO, that was also the first uh, in Cyprus. We, as we stand here, under the roof of the Home for Cooperation, we have managed uh, to, to change the fabric of the community. We are very present. We uh, became a kind of a 
uh, unifying agent between the two communities initially, but then uh, also connecting to the other communities living in Cyprus. And it symbolizes what human nature can do when there is cooperation and there is like-mindedness and multi-perspectivity and open-mindedness. The methodology we suggest, we introduce, can be used in any classroom in, in Cyprus, uh, uh, enabling children to develop critical thinking and historical understanding. I believe that if there is no change in the education system, it can be changed generally. I believe that in the past, in the past, in the past, in the past, in the past, İnsanlar tarihi gerçek gözden ve sadece tek bir bakış açısından değil de gerçekleri görebileceği bir bir okul ve eğitim sistemi sağlanır bu adada. We have showcased that we can work together, we can produce together, we can overcome our difficulties and we have been successful in that. We have many common uh, traditions, many common ways that we can build our future on. Okay, we also have differences, but they're not things that we cannot overcome.